try the cake. This is delicious. Yeah. Well, thank you. I love I'm this. Glad you like it. Yeah. It's so good. Okay, but hey, this morning we went to show you a different approach to getting the perfect Christmas tree. Yeah, this past weekend at Dull's Christmas Tree Farm in Thorntown, families got to go through the time-honored tradition of picking out that perfect tree, Yay. but instead of carrying the big tannin bombs out themselves, <laughs> they got some help from some big furry laborers. The 19th century humorist Josh Billings once wrote, Newfoundland dogs are good to save children from drowning, but you must have a pond of water handy and a child, or else there will be no profit in boarding a Newfoundland. Okay, Mr. Billings, but as you can see, Newfies are also really good at hauling Christmas trees at Dull's Tree Farm in Thorntown. He's, he's nine, but he's also great. On a recent Saturday, the tree farm was fairly flooded with Newfies, a major fundraising effort for South Central Newfoundland Rescue, an organization focused on rescuing and finding forever homes for these big, fluffy, bear-like dogs. This event is our major fundraiser to raise funds to help our Newfoundland rescues. This one is Kyle. He's not actually hauling trees today, but he and I have become friends because it turns out we weigh exactly the same, 180 pounds. This isn't the biggest tree selling day at Dull's Farm, but it might be the biggest day in terms of foot traffic. After all, who doesn't want to hang out with a pack of pony-sized, love-fueled, slobber-dripping newfies? Raising another question, how was this dog tree farm partnership formed exactly? It, it was a lady at my church. Uh, she was a nurse, and one of the other nurses that she worked with said, do you know of any tree farms that we might be able to, to take our Newfoundlands out to and, and pull trees up from the field for their customers? And she asked me about that, and I said, let me think about that. Well, yeah, <laughs> because how cool is that to, to be able to come in and have your tree pulled up uh, with a dog? So call this annual event a win-win-win. Dull's Tree Farm gets a lot of visitors. South Central Newfoundland Rescue raises a lot of money. Oh, and everyone has a lot of fun. Actually, today, my favorite one is this little girl right here named Abby that has made good friends with Vinny, this puppy. Literally, she's been on the ground rolling around with them. And that's what this is kind of all about, making memories. Oh, should, is that should, sweet? We should point out that Newfies are not for everybody. Oh, but they are. Right. They're fantastic yes. dogs. They're great therapy They're just, dogs. Very big. They slobber a lot. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Pretty but hairy. What a, what a great memory and tradition, oh, you know, for the kids for and sure. families to do that every yes. year. And that will That's stay with That's fantastic. Yeah. It really will. Okay, coming up tomorrow on Indie Style, specialty desserts for the holidays. We are making a Christmas wreath out of cupcakes, and then I'm going to share some sugary sweet details about my book signing coming up on Saturday. Plus, holiday gift ideas for pets yes. and their Speaking owners. of new fees, right? What do they want for Christmas, perhaps? <laughs> All right, Lori, let's finish off the star apples with Aren't the chocolate adorable? dessert. Yes. Yeah, so the, the, the chocolate has already hardened. And see how cute they are? It's super cute. Yes. And so you just dip your, you can use your cookie cutters to get that star shape or whatever holiday shape you'd like. Dip them in the melting chocolate. You can use candy melts. Sprinkle them like you would a Christmas yeah. cookie, and there you go. And then letting kids help, and I mean, they just love that totally. in the kitchen. It's yes. such a good lesson for and them. Then, you know, the little rings that you cut out, that's a good little snack while they're making yeah, them. Yeah, I, I, I just Cute. love the contrast of the fruit and the chocolate. It's, it's like peanut butter and chocolate. Yeah. It's right. just, you know. And it goes uh, so well together. Can I try I think one we of them? Forget. Well, yes, of okay, course you can. How long do they sit for? This, or did they, they well, go I mean, in the fridge? No, this was just, I mean, we, we dipped these at the top of the last mm. segment. So, oh, oh the okay. chocolate got... Hard so those were those. Yeah, like six. Those minutes. were those. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, this is really good, and I like the sprinkles on there too. Isn't that cute? Yum. Festive, okay, so. where can we go to maybe find all the recipes? Well, theprotismoms.com, mvapples.com, and you know, happy holidays to everyone. Ooh. I won't see you all again before Christmas Aww. because I'm not on again until January. Well, you so. remain our favorite oh, produce mom. Well, thank you. But <laughs> seriously, happy holidays, happy New yes. Year. I'll see you all. Bye, soon. everybody. We'll see you back here tomorrow. Yum.